We're going to be taking a look at the brand new Rafa 11 Carnage from HJC and retailing anywhere between 4 and 500 we're going to try and decide whether it's worth every penny of your hard earned dosh so stick around because that's coming up right now. Now there's absolutely no denying that this the Rafa 11 is an absolutely fantastically crafted piece of kit and if you're a Marvel fan this the Carnage, being the latest in the Venom lineup of graphics, is something that's probably going to float your boat. But as we said earlier, is it worth your hard earned dosh? And that's what we're here today to find out. Because this helmet costs nearly £500, I think the first question that I would be asking is... Well no, of course it's not made of gold. That would be stupid, wouldn't it? However, when it comes to helmet shell composition, it is made of some of the world's most strongest and durable materials around, being a very cleverly interwoven mix of carbon fibre, fibreglass and aramid to create what's known as a tri-composite shell. Now yes of course it's not made of gold but as far as I'm concerned it is made of the gold standard when it comes to materials for making helmets out of. Now HJC have branded this creation as PIM which means you're going to be buying a helmet with a premium integrated matrix. So in short if you do buy the helmet with those three letters on the side of the box you're going to be receiving a helmet that's probably going to be stronger, lighter and more durable than its counterparts. And that's very important when it comes to understanding how the price relates to the safety of the helmet you're about to buy. So if you're still thinking about how big a dent it's going to put in your wallet, let's have a look at some of the other things you get with this helmet. Well to be honest with you, I'm not going to tell you it's the most comfortable helmet I've ever worn, but because it does have a super soft comfort liner, it is an absolute dream to ride in. And if you're like me that likes to ride around on a hot summer's day, but sometimes gets a little bit heated up, then get this, the 8 point ventilation system in this helmet is definitely going to be your cup of tea and is definitely going to give you a cool head when you need it. It also has a system multi-cool with advanced antibacterial properties. Are you just making these words up? I don't know, but I bet you want one. Yeah, I do. Now this also provides an advanced wicking capability and an increased drying capacity over its previous interiors. If you're getting any use out of this video, we'd like to think you'd give us a thumbs up and maybe consider subscribing, as we have loads more reviews on the way, like this one where we're giving away a brand new Spartan GT next month. But for now, let's dive back into this review. Now the crown and cheek vents are also removable and washable if you want to, and let's not forget that this helmet has been designed with spectacle wearers in mind, so if you do wear specs it's going to be a comfortable helmet for you. And another thing that's worth pointing out, with that tri-composite shell, you're also going to get that decreased weight, so around about 1300 grams, this helmet is going to be much more comfortable to wear on a longer journey, because let's face it, lighter helmets result in less neck strain. Now if you're still not quite convinced about this helmet, let's have a look to see what... So I guess now that we've covered what the helmet's made of and the interior comfort of the helmet, we should probably take a look at some of the other features and benefits that you get with the Rafa 11. Now one of the other things we really liked about the HGSC Carnage is the way that they've managed to create an enlarged viewport without upsetting the aesthetic values of the helmet. Now although it's not the best helmet we've ever seen for its peripheral vision, it's certainly better than most. Now whilst we're on the subject of the visor, it's also worthwhile mentioning that it comes with HGSC's quick fire mechanism mechanism and let me tell you it's an absolute dream to work especially when it comes to changing your visor from let's say a smoked visor to a clear visor if you're out on an evening ride and things start getting a little bit dark. It has a multi-position front visor with a little locking mechanism on the front of it which as we can see is easily operational with one hand. Now here here so you've decided to go for a double D-ring fastening system which is appropriate for this sort of helmet but just to give it that little something extra they've decided to give it an anodized finish and finish it in gold. Now as standard this helmet's fitted with a removable chin curtain and a removable nose guard which is basically going to stop the wind from whistling around your chops and your visor steaming up. The Rafa also comes with quick release emergency cheek pads just in case the unthinkable ever happens. Now as if all that isn't enough to justify the price of this helmet let's take a look at the freebies you get in the box. So out of the goodness of the hearts, HJC have decided to chuck a couple of freebies in the box. So as well as the clear visor that you can see here, you also get a smoked visor. And you also get a Max Vision 120 pin lock insert. And let's not forget, 
little bag of stickers. Everybody loves a bag of stickers. Now, if you want to find out about the only helmet on the market nowadays that can probably give this bad boy a run for his money, I suggest you watch this video here, where we'll be giving away a brand new Spartan GT replicant. Don't forget to subscribe, guys. Thanks for watching. I'm out of here.